To celebrate Independence Day, crowds in Oshkosh honored our veterans. The Sawdust Days Veterans Parade marched down Main Street. Children and adults lined the street waving flags dressed in their red, white, and blue best. Those we spoke to say this is a very important part of the 4th of July celebration. Those men gave much, and to remember them is only right, and their service is the reason we're able to stand here today. Because they like gave up our lives, not for like just any random person, but like for all of us. Sawdust Days continues through the weekend at Oshkosh's Memorial Park. Now, before the parade in Oshkosh, people gathered to celebrate a 237-year-old tradition on the steps of the Winnebago County Courthouse. Fox 11's Alex Ranallo was there for the Independence Day tradition. Shoulder to shoulder, they stood, listening to words that have echoed through the ages. We hold these truths to be self-evident, that all men are created equal, that they are endowed by their creator with certain unalienable rights that among these are life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. That is probably the most recognizable phrase from the Declaration of Independence. But this crowd in Oshkosh had other favorites, too. When in the course of human events, it becomes time for one nation um, to dissolve the political bands that have held them. These usurpations and the need to cast off such governments and form a new government for our safety and welfare. Winnebago County Sheriff John Motts read the entire document to start Independence Day in Oshkosh. He told us this is a historical act. And it was signed. One of the ways of getting the word out to the colonies and the people in the colonies was to have the sheriff read the Declaration of Independence on the courthouse steps. Which the crowd that gathered appreciated. It's terrific. I think a lot of people in this country have never read it and certainly have never had it read to them. Mott said it's an honor to read because those who drafted and signed the document made huge sacrifices. Those that signed it or had anything to do with it signed their own death warrant. And that death warrant, so to speak, brought about the birth of our nation. For these citizens say we enjoy freedoms we never could if it weren't for the Declaration of Independence and the men who signed it. It's cool because that's what our forefathers wrote for us mm -hmm. to be free. Happy Fourth of the July! In Oshkosh, Alex Ranallo, Fox 11 News. This is the fourth year the Winnebago County Sheriff has read the Declaration of Independence on this holiday.